Hey guys, welcome back to my channel, Saving with Muddy. We are outside of Target today. We're gonna go in there, we're gonna grab some deals. Now this is on household items, so that's always really exciting. Um, we are going to be using Swagbucks and we're going to be using Ibotto. So those are the two apps that I'm going to use and I will leave my referral codes down below if you don't have them and you would like to sign up for those. Oh, also there's supposed to be a toy clearance going on. So we're probably gonna take a quick peek to see if we find anything. Um, but yeah guys let's hit in there the first swag book deal we have going on is on some clorox sprays so i'm picking up two that are priced at 4.99 now the ones i'm picking up are these free and clear the multi-surface cleaner sprays so swag Bucks is giving back five dollars for purchasing two with a limit of two per month so let's do the breakdown we're picking up two that's going to total us up to 9.98 we'll pay that out of pocket but submit for five dollars back making them just 4.98 for both now I do also want to mention that these specific Clorox sprays that say uh, free and clear are attaching to two offers on swag bucks. So the first one that I mentioned and then the second one is um, when you purchase two you will get three dollars back. Um, so I'll keep an eye on that. I will let y'all know if I do get the additional three dollars for it. But if I do it will be a dollar and ninety eight for two or just ninety nine cents each. We are also going to pick up some Clorox bleach. Now let me put them in my car real quick and then I will show you all the breakdown. And this deal is a limit of two on Swagbook, so we are going to be picking up four. Alrighty guys, so let's look at this breakdown. So the Clorox bleach are priced at $3.79. Um, Swagbucks is giving back 550 Swagbucks or $5.50 for purchasing two. So uh, right now we're at $7.58 between both of them. We'll pay that out of pocket, but submit our receipt, making them just $2.08 for both or $1.04 each. Between all of my Clorox products, I am at $35.12. However, my account did receive a save a ten dollars um whenever you spend fifty dollars on select household items so i'm going to be using that so check your accounts to see if you have that and to get to my fifty dollars i'm going to be picking up a bounty that is priced at 16.99 um, so let's go ahead and add this So now my cart totals up to 50 to 11 and I'm going to be using that save 10 when you spend 50 so that's going to take $10 off leaving me to pay $42.11 out of pocket but then I'm going to submit a swag books for $21 and then to um, Ibotta for $4 back on the bounty making my final cost just $17.11 for everything in my cart however if the Clorox sprays do attach to that second offer on swag bucks and i get the money back from there as well so the additional six dollars from that that will make my final cost just eleven dollars and eleven cents for everything that i have and i have one more deal for y'all using swag bucks. so it's on the clorox wipe the 35 count ones that are priced at 339 um, so swag bucks is giving back 350 swag bucks or three dollars and fifty cents for purchasing two so we'll pay six seventy eight for two of these. Then we will submit our receipt to swag books for three dollars and fifty cents back, making them just three twenty eight for both. And guys, I am running super low on um some Clorox wipes, so I am so happy to pick up this deal. And using the Target app, we are going to use a digital. So come over here to the travel size section and pick up some small kleenexes that are priced at a dollar 19. we do have a dollar digital attaching to this making it just 19 cents now i'm gonna grab a second pack and scan it on shopmium to see if it attaches to their dollar digital as well um i'm gonna scan it first to make sure but if it does we will take both if not we will put one back so I went ahead and scanned it on Shopmium and it is not attaching so we're putting one back but the dollar digital from the Target um, app does attach. And we can't come to Target without looking at their clearance. So I'm kind of tempting on taking this one. I am really tempted. It's an apple peeler and it's 50% off. And I've seen it before and I kind of want it, but I don't know. Um, they also have these toys down here and I know these should be on clearance. So I'm going to take a picture of their barcode and go scan them. The vending machine is on clearance for $39.99. It was almost $80. And then the food counter is on clearance for $54.99. We are in the toy section and I'm not really seeing any clearance. So like clearance tags are the yellow tags. These are more of their regular sale tags. So I'm going to keep looking. 
I don't think we're gonna have any luck at this Target with the clearance tags or clearance toys. They only have like regular sales. So they do have this end cap and not everything on here is on clearance. So it's not really what I was looking for. So let's just go ahead and check out with what we have. Alrighty guys, so we are back in the car from Target and everything worked out perfect. I already went ahead and submitted my receipt to Swagbucks and to Ibotta um, just in case those rebate offers would disappear, which I doubt it, but I just went ahead and did it already. Um, so let me go show y'all my receipt actually. Uh, so here is everything that I got. Oh, hopefully it focuses. Um, that lighting is not the best. All right, so real quick, this is everything that I got. All of my items scanned perfectly. My subtotal came up to $55.42. So that's what I paid out of pocket. But then I submitted my receipt to Swagbucks for $28 back. And then I submitted my receipt to Ibotta for $4 back. So that brings my total down to just $23.42 for everything that I picked up today. Now for Swagbucks, Remember how the um, Clorox sprays was attaching to two offers, so it gave me the five dollars, uh, the five dollar offer back, um, no issue. Now the one with the three dollar, the three dollar offer, I'm trying to like say it where it's not too confusing, but the three dollar offer it kind of went straight to pending. So if it does give me the additional six dollars back on Swagbucks for the um, Clorox sprays then that makes my final cost just $17.42 for everything that I got today, which is really, really good. Um, but other than that, guys, that is everything that I have for y'all. The toy clearance was kind of disappointing because I did not see any clearance tags. It was like your typical, normal um, Target sales, and they had like an end date and everything. So it's just your regular Target sales but no clearance at this Target, which was really weird because normally this is a Target that I find clearance at. Um, but yeah, guys, other than that, that's how my Target uh, trip went. And that is everything that I have for y'all. Thank you so much for being here. Don't forget to like this video and subscribe to my channel if you haven't. And I will see you on the next one. Bye, guys.